We are currently at the 8 minute mark. Score is at 4 to 0. Jerome Lestemoza goes all the way to the basket. Paul Manalang now at the top. Brings it to Brian Santos from the top of the key and swishes in the first three out of Coachman and Sala for the USD Growling Tigers. Shot clock reads four. Jerome Lestemoza from beyond the yard drills another three for him. Okay, so hungrier for more back at the panel. Thank you so much, Aaron. So far, Jerome Lastimosa already scoring nine points in the opening frame. Rebound by Cabanero. USD is running. Cabanero goes all the way to the basket. And you know, and that's one of the things that USD has to try to try to get into breaks, try to get into transition, to get those easy baskets because they've really had a hard time when they're in the when they have to face a defense. Six minute mark, Adamson still leading 13 to 5. <laughs> El Jerome Destemosa loses defenders with that crossover. Very good, etc. <laughs> he just burned him. That's right. And Nick Cabanero getting the rebound and kissing it off the glass. Paul Manala with a shake and bake and a great setup job there to Manaitai. Getting back into this ball game, Jerome Listimosa up against Paul Manala. Three seconds remaining. Turnaround, pull up is good. Yeah, that, that's all Jerome. Although even us, we've enjoyed watching him so far <laughs> in this first quarter. That's right. He got the ISO and got the shot that he wanted. Paul Manala though answering back. That's a Yamaha three-point shot. Cedric Manzano coming off a big game versus UP and gets that basket in. He's wearing some big shoes now. Another three-point shot here for the USD Growling Tigers to the USD side of things with Fiona Bacani. Fiona? People aren't calling this 18-year-old rookie the future King Tiger for nothing. Back and forth action here and a great pass to the cutting Dave Ando. And that's what USC needed. I know that they like throwing up those three-point shots, but... As Joshua Fantanilla tries his luck here, last possession for USD, puts it up and gets that up and in as after 10 minutes of action here in the first quarter, it's only a slim one-point margin for the Adams and Soaring Falcons leading 22 to 21. And that has enabled USD also to get back into the ball game. As mentioning, they ended the first quarter on a 16 to 7 run. Vince McGuas though drills the lead from the top of the key. That's a UFC your heart. And and that's the, the big one for for Addison because they've actually slowed down offensively. Finally ran something that got everyone involved. With so much swag, sabi niya no chill daw. Going into this game, dahil parehas lang naman daw. Gusto ko manalo. At kung si Nika Banyero ng USD, ay excited makalaro si Jerome. Ito namang si Cedric. And with, with Duanga in, in there, that's actually one of the bigger problems of USD is that they don't have size. And Adamson right there taking full advantage of it. And on point, as you mentioned, right now on the board is Lenda Duanga with his first two points. Joshua Fontanilla. Paul Manalang now. Eight seconds to work on the 24. Nico Banero out from three. Swishes that in to get back into the lead. 28 to 27. Parang ano yun eh, Bea? Not a bad consolation prize. That's right, that's right. But I'm sure all these players, and speaking of Vince Bakuwa scoring his second three of the ball game, checking back into the ball game. Joshua Fontanina thought about the three, great separation and drills a three for USD. Another offensive rebound and Zaldivar with the putback. Them to stick close to Adamson, 36 to 31. Paul Manalang kicks it out to Cabanero. Six to shoot. Cabanero with a floater. That's good. This turn on the offensive side to create something for himself. Oh, nice. Uh, Joe Sabandal going 
coast to coast. In that number four and exactly. really push USD into a, a big problem and trying to make it all the way back. Pedomina and there's a three from the left wing. The bigger Keith Zaldivar. Paul Manala trying to shake and bake Zaldivar out to the corner. Three for JC Gooding. That's up and in. And a timeout on the floor is called. Balls in the hands of their main gunner, Jerome Nestemosa. Out to uh, Edolon from the corner, unable to convert. And after 20 minutes of action, Adamson with a slim lead, 41 to 40, to Miguel Pangalina, and stripped away by Joshua Yero. Manzano trailing behind. Manzano off the glass, the basket, and the foul is good for him. That uh, hounded them. Joshua Fontanilla. Calling out the play for USC. Joshua Fontanilla spins and gets the basket. Good for him. Right. And, and Joem Sabandai. Tries to shake off just a limb. Fakes, fires, and scores. Uh, Sabandai there just. Um, no play called, just trying to attack the defense of USD. Joshua Yero goes down to Joel Sabandai up against Miguel Pavelina. Great pass to the running Yero inside the basket. And it's a, the, the patience and the pace. Sometimes you don't have to go too fast. You know, uh, level no USD somewhere. Only four points so far for USD as Keith Lopez Barr. Finishes with the left hand. You see right now, all of a sudden, it's already a double-digit lead. So far, the place has slowed down and has worked in the favor of the Adams and Soaring Falcons with their biggest lead. Other than what they were running earlier, a lot of single highs. A little more extra passing, but unable to convert Les De Mosa, though, with a tip in. And that's the first field goal of Les De Mosa since the first quarter. And, and, you know, you, you might be going on, but he's not taking shots. But also, that lead as Baluli has not uh, had, uh, he's not forced any shots. Finds just a line for three. Too strong. Uh, Paul Manala with another opportunity. Sherman puts a shot. Yes, his first time. But this one coming out of offensive rebounds, very hard to locate out of offensive rebounds. Keep your head up and hit that three. And Paul Manana with the pushback. Still no good. Cabanero with a third try. Cabanero finally that's good. And the one thing that has helped you is. Shot clock is off. Destimosa drives. Destimosa scores. Hold you. That's, that's the thing. Jerome Nestemosa leading the way with 22 big points for the Adamson Soaring Falcons as Adamson currently leading 66 to 52. <laughs> On their defense, Joanne Sab Sabandal brings it down low to Duanga with an easy two points. That's just much communication. It's very difficult. In favor of the Adamson Soaring Falcons at the end of two quarters, but Adamson really pushing on the gas pedals in the third quarter with a 25 to 12. Jerome Lastimosa back here to the ball game. Nero for three. Too strong, and Paul Manalang tips it to the wrong guy. Vince McGuas goes all the way for the easy two points. U UP or FEU. But hoping to end this game on a better note, Joshua Fontanilla. Five years from 50. Gets that to trickle in. And now at 78. Additional, before we hit the two minute mark, is that they have a longer break. The next game is on Tuesday. Oh, no, no, no. Not that one day break, so they have a time to fix what they need to fix. Uh, but don't look now, you know, Paul Manala uh, trying to still Adam cut the here by USD. Joshua Fontanilla on the baseline, drops it down to Herrera. Uh, unable painful. to convert, but Nick Pagano is there. The basket oh. and the foul. And the Adamson soaring Falcons with a resounding win here versus the USC Grounding Tigers, backed up by the Ladies big the third quarter outscoring USC, USC 25 to 12 to have this big win. More importantly, 80. extending their winning streak to four games and going out of that middle of the pack, improving their standings now to five and six.